Hello everybody and welcome back to Casual Game Rise as we continue our F1 2017 career mode season 3 with Toro Rosso driver Ben Waterworth. My name is Ben Waterworth and we're in to round 6 in Monaco. We're going to go straight into this. Because you know our worst qualifying and best qualifying is exactly the same. Dead last. We've been dead last in every single one of our qualifying sessions uh, here at Monaco. And that just happened. Wow. Um, and before you say it, no, I didn't do that deliberately. Um, the worst possible way to start our weekend here in Monaco... We knew that was going to happen anyway, but it's probably worse for our reputation because we retired and didn't actually um, finish the session. So <sighs> Alonso has become our jinx in terms of just making us get into some because we're having such a good start to this season. And uh, the little prick after Spain has uh, gotten in my head. So yeah, we'll start last from Monaco. You knew that was going to happen. Ferrari... Six consecutive pole for them. That's some positives. Let's hope it continues into a win at least. Uh, let's move into the race there, Monaco, and uh, end up finishing last. I'm going to do that now. Yeah, you can tell I'm extremely thrilled about the prospect of this race. I only ever finished one Monaco Grand Prix. That was last year, and of course we were dead last. But um, Actually, we weren't dead last. We were 19th. Uh, but you know the expectation here is going to be like 17th, which we won't be able to meet. Um, it would be great if they could put my expectation at 19th here. Um... Cause maybe then I can like deliberately take a car out in the first corner and then just pit and yeah. Um, it's just frustrating. I'm just going to keep going over and over again. I get 30 development points. Cool. Um, I was actually meant to be an 18th. So okay. So I'm oh, getting thrashed in the rivalry again. Reputation is zero. Um, we're banging out for 1400. Uh, development points because that's going to get us our final little thing and we can develop the shit out of the engine which i think if i did the uh simulation sections right if we finally get that through all of it uh we move ahead of haas so we're second worst team at the moment but we might actually be doing this a lot better than expected because i didn't think we'd probably reach 1400 to about britain but uh given we won't really get many this round but we should get a few good ones in canada and if i can finish azerbaijan then we can get some more so we might be able to get that development point up before Austria, which would be fantastic, and then we might even be able to look at some uh, upgrades in the car by Britain, which would come in handy. So, um, got to do, got to perform well. And I would have in Spain, but I'm going to be on the outside here. But I'm at the back of the grid. I should have done the new engine, but I didn't. Wasn't thinking. Anyway, how long will our Monaco Grand Prix experience last? You know by uh, how long this video is for, obviously, given that you would have uh, seen it here on YouTube already. As, uh, well, we get a little bit out of shape there coming up into turn one. And, uh, well, our expectation is 19th, so that's a positive. As, uh, that's what we kind of wanted. And right now... Oh, I thought I was still in 19th. I'm not, anyway. It's almost worth taking one of these guys out deliberately. Damaging the front wing. Let's do that. Oh. Because that way, if we take one out, uh, or at least damage it, then we uh, we find ourselves in 19th. So uh, hopefully by doing what I just did with Ericsson, I've damaged his car so he has to pit. So then I can just limp around. <laughs> yeah, okay, it's cheating. I think he's out of the race too. I'm pretty sure I've managed to succeed in doing what I try to do there, people. Whoa, 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 oh, whoa! And it doesn't even fucking matter! Oh! God damn it! What did I do? That's exactly what happened, I think, in the first season. I just get too complacent coming out of the tunnel. <sighs> clip there, clip there, out. Considering you've seen this video is about six minutes long, and you knew that was about to happen. <sighs> oh, you think I'd be improving by now, wouldn't you? Um, I'm just getting frustrated. <sighs> anyway. Anyway. Ferrari wins. So, cool. Um, I just need a quick look to see. He got going. How? Uh, just ignore me right now, kids. I'm just. Why do I keep calling you kids? I really don't know why. 
I want to see what I actually did to uh, Ericsson here. <laughs> so I kind of just... Did I damage his front wing? He's like going silly buggers. I don't know if I damaged his front wing at all. Well, there's parts on the road there, and it wasn't mine. Anyway, whatever. Raikkonen, Vettel, Hamilton, Bottas, Massa, blah, 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 blah. Our standings are Raikkonen. Well, Ferrari have not lost a race this season, so the positives are there that they look like they can actually finally win a championship in this game. Um, and, yeah, nothing different. Anyway, positives. Canada is next. Hopefully we can get a result there. We need a result after two very bad Grand Prix. Three if you can't rush her after what happened there in many ways. Like, subscribe, comment, tell us how shit we are, because we really are shit. But uh, this has been Casual Gamer Oz, and we'll speak to you in Canada. Good night.